Would it be Islamophobic of me to ask the mosque near my house to chant softer? If it happens during normal daylight hours, you will probably not be able to do much about it. They will probably say sorry but there's not much else that they will do. Earplugs, white noise machines, etc. I use Bose sleep buds. They work great. There is no way to approach this. You think they are going to chant softer so you can sleep better? Flushed. Earplugs. Can't hurt to ask but as a fellow night shift worker, the general consensus is that it's your problem. Well that I find anyway. Builders, gardeners etc. have to use their tools and it really isn't their problem if you or I work. Nights. I will say I find Muslim call to prayer and all that quiet soothing to listen to as a non-Muslim. But that's me I'm also the weirdo who can't sleep without a fan on for the noise and breeze. Was the mosque there before or after you moved? Wear earplugs. You can ask politely. May get a few stares but honestly you can't do much. I am assuming you moved in after the mosque was built. This means you willingly moved in near a mosque. The center of a religion that has had the same worship schedule for a millennium. This means that as long as it is the waking hour you cannot expect them to quiet down. Unless your local area has specific laws restricting noise before a certain time. Only the morning prayer you can ask to quiet down but nothing else you can make them do. You can try buying some sound insulation or if on a budget earplugs. But they were probably there first and do have the right to pray. Though, best case scenario you can ask the imam politely and they will politely try to pray a bit quieter. But there are no guarantees it would work. I don't think you should. I'm going to guess the mosque was there before you started living there. I would look into earplugs, soundproofing if it's affecting your sleep. Realistically, they aren't going to chant softer for you. My advice is to move if it's bothering you. This is like moving next door to a school and then complaining that there are so many children around. Move. There is no way to fix this. You live near something loud and you are the outlier. They would probably laugh at you thinking you are joking. It's not gonna happen. Earplugs FTW or a white noise track playing on loop. Haha <laughs> <laughs> can you please film when you ask them? I would like to see their response. I very much doubt they would but hey. You don't ask. You don't get. I don't even think it's worth the effort bro, there's no way they're gonna oblige. Unfortunately made I believe you wouldn't get much help but wouldn't harm to ask. And it is not at all Islamophobic to make a request that soothes you better. It won't be, but as a person that lives in a Islamic country there isn't a way to lower the voices. I live right beside a mosque I know how you feel I'm so used to it I don't even notice the chanting. Sometimes. Is what I say as I wake up at 5 am from the chanting. Could be worse though. At least it is quite relaxing how they chant. Oh my god this comment section is awful. To everyone here judging off for even asking this question. You know what sub this is right? Are you talking about the call to prayer or the prayers themselves? You can try to go to the Imam and explain to him your situation. You might be able to convince him to turn the volume on the call a little. But you'd literally be disturbing the routine of all the other people because you do night shifts. This is kind of like people complaining about dogs barking or birds chirping. Not really much you can do about it. TBH the only real solution would be for you to either move, install better sound isolation, or change jobs. Imagine this. You are on a train and you want to listen to your own music but the announcements are annoying you. 
Do you go and complain to them to not make announcements or do you just plug in your earphones and let it die out in the background? Your personal problems does not count compared to everyone else's comfort just because you do a night shift. Also I am gonna assume that this chance are the call for prayer which happens five times a day. But most places if it's not a Muslim country, area they usually skip the early morning one. 5 a.m. And usually do the other ones which are roughly at 12 p.m. 3 p.m. 5 p.m. and 7 p.m. Time may vary depending on sunrise, sunset. And it lasts about a minute. Are you really gonna complain about one minute of sound? Those are perfectly normal times so it is really a you problem. You can ask but you will just be told off. Naturally by anyone. Do yourself a favor and don't even ask. Just buy some earphone, change your job, or change your house. If you enjoyed this video, please check out our playlists full of similar content. Epicaracast is like doom scrolling for your ears. Please like, share, and subscribe.